Hey guys, welcome to another video and today I'm going to show you how to edit your WordPress theme files. And once again, our WordPress installation was set up using InstaWP and this service allows you to set up up to 10 WordPress installations free of charge. If you register, they stay online for up to 48 hours, but if you don't, they stay online for up to 8 hours. So check them out, InstaWP.io. So today we want to edit our WordPress theme files and what we want to do is change our page background color. So let's go over to our website, um, click visit site, open in a new tab. And we see that the background color of our website is green so we want to change it. So let's use the customizer to change this background color. So go to customize and click additional CSS. So we have some code that we need to copy and paste into our CSS section and this will be in, in the description so you can follow. So let's just paste this code into our website. So our page background is now purple. Let's click publish to save our changes and we can also change our background color by editing this hex code. Let's take it back to purple. All right, so all we need to do is publish our changes, click publish, then go back to our website and reload the page. Okay, so we have our purple color back. Go back to the customizer and let's delete this code. Okay, so we have our green color back. Let's reload this, let's publish and then reload. All right, so we have our green color back and right now I'm gonna show you how to do the same thing using another method. So we are going to use our theme editor, go to theme editor. And we are going to be changing our page background color by editing this style.css file. So go all the way to the bottom. On the last line, we need to paste the same code that we put in our customizer. So let's go to our code, copy and paste. Once again, this will be in the description for you to follow. So let's go to our last line and paste this code. Okay, let's click update file. All right, so let's go back to our site and reload our page. So you notice that our page color did not change and this is because our site is being cached. So we need to go to our settings, go to settings and type cache. Click clear browsing data and let's delete our data for the last hour. So click clear data at the bottom and let's go back to our website, reload and our page color is now purple again. Okay, so I'm going to show you guys how to edit your WordPress theme files using FTP. So we are going to remove this code and update file. So you can use any FTP client, but I'm using Cyberduck. And I already have my settings saved, so I'm just going to click this to log into my website. So as soon as you log in, find your website's root folder and go to WP Content. Once you're there, find your Themes folder. Click Themes. And click the name of your theme. So it's 2021 for me. And let's find our style sheet. So it's um, style.css. And we actually need to right click on this and download this file. So we can click download, but let's duplicate this file first so that we have a backup. If anything goes wrong, we can um, revert to this backup. So call this tile copy. All right, so we have our backup style sheet. So all we need to do right now is actually download our um, original style sheet and edit it. So let's click download. And once the process is complete, we just need to browse our computer for the file. Let's right click our style sheet, open with, and select a text editor. So I'm going to be using VSC, Visual Studio Code. Okay, so we just need to scroll all the way down to the bottom of our style sheet, just like in our theme editor. And we need to paste our code on the last line. And the cool thing about this text editor is it actually shows you the color of your hex code. So once we're done, we just need to save our file. So click save. 
So let's find it on our computer and we need to actually upload this file to our WP content folder. So if you get a prompt asking if you want to overwrite the file, click yes. And once we have uploaded our file, we need to go back to our website and reload our page. Click reload. Once again, our page color did not change. So we need to clear our browsing data. So click clear data. Let's reload our page again. All right. So we have successfully changed our page color. So the last thing I'm going to show you guys is how to change your WordPress version. So let's right click on our page and click view page source. All right. So if you look on line 39, we'll see that we have our WordPress version. It's 5.7.2 and we just want to hide this. So let's go back to our dashboard and in our theme editor, let's click theme functions. Okay, so we need to scroll all the way down to the bottom until we find the last line. So right here, this is where we need to paste our code. And here's our code, so let's copy it. And this will be in the description as well. So one more time, I want to show you guys what we will be removing. So we'll be removing our WordPress version, line 39. So let's go back to our theme editor to paste our code. Click update file. Let's go back to our page source. Reload. Okay, so we have successfully removed our WordPress version.